American teaching and other teachings in past week or two, and emphasizing more and more, is many of you have built these, all these reactors, and you stood the work of what I call a star formation. In the shape, if you understand, each one has made its own star formation. That's one base. And the three bases of the fields that you need in different levels to create the manifestation of the field, to become tangible. In a way, what I see and what we're trying to get you to understand and further develop is this, that forget about what we call physical system and concentrate on the field. This is what the next generation of the work has to be. In a way that the interaction of the field has to be considered and not the motors and reactors. This is where the next step in understanding the work of the universal physics come into operation. Where we don't look at the tangibility, we look at the field forces effect. We don't look that we have ganses, we create the condition that the fields of the universe become interactive in a condition and a position that we want. In a way, as part of the new teaching, as you saw in the ball rotating around an imaginary center to show its position, that imaginary center has to become the soul of the man. The soul of the physicality deciding if it wants to put its field strength to manifest for us to see the reactors. Not by building reactors to show the manifestation of a system. The knowledge of the knowledge seekers has to become part of understanding the creation of the field, absorption of the field, separation of the field, division of the fields, through the use of the interaction of the field of the soul of the man and the soul of the physicality. The way the interaction of the fields of the earth and the sun creates the daylight and gives different light in different positions and angles. The soul of the man and the soul of physicality of the man has to understand this, that it creates the same. In interaction of different fields of strength in different angles, it creates different matter condition of the manifestation if they wish. The way that the field of the sun and the earth in a given angle creates the trees and in another angle creates the shrubs, and in another angle, in another part of the world, creates another tree and a different shrub. So, now we understand that the knowledge has to extend into the dimension of fields, that through it, if we wish, we can create the matter state or manifestation state, without the matter. We know that this exists as we create ganses which are not in a matter state, but in a condensed plasma condition that we see and absorb and observe them as plasmas in motion. Only when you bring the fourth state of field as an inertia, which you come to touch, then the gans 
manifest itself in a matter state. Before that, is in the state of plasma. And it is the way that many of you, many of the knowledge seekers, have to start working without existence of the matters. The way I said before, you put your hand out and you wish gold. You wish an apple. The emotion of the apple is registered within your brain. The soul of the man, through the eye of the man, sees the object and through the dimension of the soul of the physicality, creates the apple in the hand of the man. 